today's video, I want to share with you one of my solutions that helped me to solve an issue I've encountered recently. My objective was to transfer an image from AWS to my application. However, response is in the application object stream, which is not conducive to displaying or reading the image. I require the image to be in base64 format. Despite trying various solutions, I have been unable to achieve success. The response I received is comparable to this. It's something like, a, it looks like a binary data. So first of all, what you, you need to do is to make an API call to your server to get the required data. In, your, in my case, I've used uh, the Axios library where I have defined the headers and content type is application of the stream and response type should be array buffer. Here you can define, you can select uh, a lot of some of them, but uh, we need only array buffer. After all this, after when you got the data, uh, you need to make some manipulations in your function. First of all, you need to convert your bind array buffer to a unit eight array and iterate through the binary data in chunks specified by buffer size. In your cycle, you need to concatenate the chunk into a new, the new array and to use the set and to use the set uh, to store only unique uh, information. After you need to create the block from the concatenated binary data with specified mine type. In my case, I need the image PNG. And, and when you go the blob, you need to create a temporary URL, URL for the blob. And in the end, to, the, to resolve the promise with the temporary URL. So, if you have some questions and if you want me to help you with this issue, you can contact me and I will help you.